Hey guys, welcome. Welcome back if you're returning today. Uh, my name is Tina and today I'm going to be setting up the second to the last week in my planner. I am pulling out an oldie but a goodie. It's this colorful life. Um, I got this one on clearance a ways back, but I have some old sheets from before. That was when I tore the books apart. I don't suggest doing that. And then I have colorful boxes and colorful basics to kind of go with it. Um, <clears throat> oh, these have been worn down. Uh, so I did not realize that this year is flying by and it's the, the closer it gets to the end of the year, the faster it time goes and it's just crazy. So um, I was thinking about what I was going to do for this week and realized I have this week and next week in my 2024 planner and then I'm done. I moved to my new planner because I do that for the combined week. Um, so this is kind of surreal and it's Kind of just hit me. Not ready for it, but okay, here we go. <clears throat> so I'm going to use a color scheme of red and green. I'm not quite ready to throw Christmas on this spread, um, but I will throw. It. Okay, so there's one. So there's this one. And then there's this which is the red boxes and um, if i do red and green i can use the red boxes here and um, use like these line boxes to go on them to write <clears throat> and some regular boxes and see where it goes so at uh, first i'm going to wipe these out because I'm probably thinking I'm a little spunky enough I'm going to change things up but I also want to see I don't know if I have I don't want to add another pattern <laughs> um, I was thinking if I had any washi but I do not have any washi that will not add another pattern in those colors. So we're just going to go with what's in here. Um, now I don't advocate dismantling the entire book, but occasionally I will tear out pages um, in books to bring it up to another set of pages. So this is the ones, these are the ones I'm going to be basing it off of. So I'm going to tear these out to make it easier to work with. And then in here, I have a red box that I want to work with. So I think I'm going to pull that out now. And then I have other smaller boxes, but this is one of the larger boxes that I'm going to be working with. So, oh, I'm not quite sure where I'm going with this. Let me put that off to the side over there, but now I have it because sometimes I can't find what I need. I do need some smaller red and maybe some green boxes for there. Oh, those are probably all up front. Okay, so here's a red box. And then, oh, look, I have a green. I wasn't sure if it was going to have one that matched. So we'll do this one over here. If you're new here, this is where I um, put my boys' schedules. And their work schedules are um, a little challenging at times to schedule things around so they're not that is neither one of these is straight um 
My oldest son has a, I guess you'd call it a rotating schedule. And my younger son, his is a little bit more steady as you go, but there are times that, like at the end of this year that he is working this day, but not that day kind of thing. And they're trying to do stuff like that to get time off of, um, for more time off of the holiday. I knew where I was going with that. Okay, so I'm gonna throw some fun in here because I thought these were really just a lot of, you know, just looking a lot of fun. So I figured they would be perfect to put in some of here and then splash around over there. I'm going to take this box here and I think the border will help with that busy. Um, and I'm going to line it up here and then line it up over here. So it just kind of offsets it and it brings a splash of color in. Um, so I have green and then let me see. I need to look at my schedule. Ha, ha, ha. I'm going to go willy nilly and go, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. So hmm. let's put this over here. I'm going to need a small, I'll do a small red one on here. Oops. Excuse me. And I know it seems a little chaotic, but it's, one of those things that I just, <clears throat> my da my daughter's schedule and mine are a little wonky. And um, okay, hold on, these need to move over. Okay, ah, let go. So this one's not straight, which is no surprise. If you're new here, you will find that if I get it straight on the first go, that's pretty miraculous. But nor, more times than not, it is um, slightly off kilter. And sometimes we just leave it that way because, you know, it's just the way of life. Sometimes life is off kilter and we just kind of <laughs> go with the blow. So I'm going to try to get that as straight as possible. And I know it's a slightly different red, but we're just going to be okay with that. Um, so there are three events going on here. So I think I'm going to pull some of the dots and we're going to utilize some of those because I think those will be really cute. Um, yeah, they're pretty much the same. I think I'm going to use these little uh, star thingies, whatever you call them. little flower looking things and we're just gonna go down the row oh look there's one right there and we're just gonna put another one just because we might have a fourth thing but then that will be ready to go there it's going to be a busier week than it has been lately We'll just go with that. Okay, so Thursday is my next scheduled thing, and I think I'm going to do a red. Do the red stripes, and we're gonna do the green theme here. We're just gonna kind of mimic what I did up here. Uh, I don't think I need the other box. So we're just going to leave that, but I know if I need to, I can either take a darker pen and right here, or I can add, add another box and then that will work. So then we've got, this is the 20th. Oh, we got an appointment here and I did not 
plan that. Let me see if I have, oh, look at that. I have my appointment stickers right there. So, hmm, mm hmm. I kind of want to put something down, but I don't want to. So these are, none of these have appointments. It's been a long time since I've used those. Um, so I want to use a little bit bigger of a red, I think, in that spot without the lines. Because um, you might be like, hey, there's one right there without the line, or with lines. And I'm going to tell you I'd prefer to have it without the lines. So, I don't know what that is. Um, it's sticky from somewhere else. What is the difference in these? Other than maybe shade? I don't see much of a difference, so we'll just stick that one out over there because we'll probably use that. And we will do this one here. And if you've noticed, I like putting them up at the top when I am planning my pre planned things because I like being able to fill in here and have. The, as much pre-planned stuff at the top and the bottom is, you know, an area that I can write in and add things to. So, and now it looks like it's going to be pretty. We've got um, a candlelight service here, uh, I believe. So we're going to add these cute little dots. These are adorable. It's going to be a little bright and fun. And then I'm going to take, what did I just do with that box? Hold, please. What did I do with that? Okay. I put it way over there. Um, I want a large red box. that I can add more words to than the mid, I should say medium sized box. Okay, so that's looking kind of bright and fun and a little extra cheerful. Um, I just kind of wanted to bring in some red and green theme and now I'm gonna bring in this side because this side's gonna be a little um, touch and go. Where is, there's this one. So I think it's going to be mostly, if anything, I'd pull one of these. But I'm not sure I need to. So I'm going to just drop this down here. Because we're going to put a title up here. I don't want to put too many of these together, but um, we're going to take this one. I kind of want like a green one over there. Not that one. So we'll put that one back. I don't have another. Do more with less. That looks good. Okay. So I'm going to layer that one right there. And I think I might have, hmm. let's see, coffee time, be kind, good things take time. And I'm trying to figure out what I want to do with the rest of this because I really don't have a decorative element. Um, so to speak, so I also don't want to be 
layering crazy patterns on top of crazy patterns. Um, I guess we can take this one and let me see what I can find as far as green to offset it here. I forgot I can use some of the larger red boxes. So there's that because I don't want the solid green. We're going to try this. See how this goes. Might have to do something here. I'm not sure. Might just leave it. Um, let me see where some of these, I think I have larger, yep, I got a couple larger red ones. So, in fact, okay, so there's that one, and then there's this one, and we've got a green. I don't want it that way, that herringbone. Maybe we will just take it and do red. And I know that's going in upside down, but that's okay. Because it's mine and I'm fine with it. <laughs> Let's see. I think I'm... Those lines, let me tell you. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to turn it over and we're going to cover most of those. And I know it's not going to offset a whole lot because it's not going to. Be very visible. And we're just going to have some empty spaces. Oop, not there. I think I'm going to move it over this way a bit. Um, I'm not putting it down yet because I'm going to see <laughs> where I'm going with this. Where am I going? Because I kind of want to just put a bunch of different um, boxes. So, where's the green? There's some small, mid size. So, I'm trying to see if I have any. Others. And then this one is not it. I have some small ones. Or I have these. So I think I'm going to actually try to integrate this. Um, can move this one this way put it this way I'm I am at a impasse let's see because I don't want to bring in this especially because right now it's just really I think that's too many patterns on the same page but I might change it out because see let's see how that one works out let me Tuck those over there and see if okay. I just took off some of the white out, it's fine. It's okay. Alright, so we'll tuck that one this way. And we'll see what this one does. Because I'm liking this color scheme. I am really, really liking it. So you know what I might do is keep it upright like this. And go a couple different directions with it. So I don't want to put too much of the same over there. Um, I'm going to do that. And then, and then, 
because I want to bring those other boxes in because I need the boxes on this side. So. Hmm. Oh, come on. Hold on. I'm trying to get the <laughs> trying to get it to not stick to me very much here while I'm trying something out. I think I kind of like it just because it's different. I haven't done this before. Let me get these straight. Ah, okay. Let me do that. Get this over here. Well, you know what? Let's do this one first. Because I know. We'll move this down a little bit. And get that there. <clears throat> and then we'll overlap this one over these two. A bit and then we can add little stickers here and there and I think it will turn out really cute we're gonna bring some of this over here And let's see. And yes, I know some of those are slightly crooked, but I'm not going to mess with them too much this week. Um, today is the perfect day to be happy. Let's see if we've got something over here. Stay humble, work hard. Kind of want to put some more dots on here um, okay we're gonna put hearts over here just a couple I'm not doing um, crazy amount of hearts per box I just have a couple that um, we're gonna do stars down here because you never know what's going to pop up and what I may have forgotten. Yeah, I think they're all pretty much similar, but that's okay. Um, I kind of want to put something up here. I don't want to... I think I'm going to put uh, the plan ahead over here because this may be the day that I have to plan for the next week and um, that will remind me to plan for the next week because it's Christmas week after this. Okay, let me get this in and let's see where we are. Okay, so that is, it's bright, it's fun, and a little funky. Um, I wanted to dive back into this uh, colorful, what is it, the colorful life? Yeah, this colorful life. So primarily, primarily came out of this one, if you can find this book. This I think I got a year or two ago at Joann's on clearance, so I'm not sure if you can find them anymore. Um, but maybe there's some floating out there. Um, I hope that this inspired you, and if you like this content, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.